Uh, otherwise, mainly sunny as we get further into the day. And we are going to have, similar to yesterday, a wide range in where our high temperatures end up, depending on where you are. That's going to be the case really for the next few days here, uh, thanks to the fact that we're going to keep a breeze coming in kind of from the north and northeast. So a little bit of that Lake Erie influence the closer you are to the lake shore. Uh, out there right now, cool, uh, wilder along the lake shore, 30 degrees right now. Areas further inland, though, have dropped into the 20s. So we're going to work on rebuilding those temperatures as we we go through the day and I really see a nice warm up overall. We were expecting some cloud cover to kind of rebuild through the overnight. Uh, that has not happened for most of us. So that's why our inland temperatures are running colder, uh, but that means we are going to get some sunshine into the mix earlier in the day, which is going to be nice. High pressure is just off to our north, so that's going to keep us nice and dry uh, and quiet. We've got a system building across the plains and down through the south, and we see a lot of clouds, a lot of rain with that, but our high pressure is going to be protecting us a little bit. Uh, from that. So not going to be an issue for us. We are going to stay nice and dry for today. So again, cold uh, for our inland areas this morning, but we are going to see those temperatures improving thanks to a good deal of sunshine. Our winds are going to be coming in mainly from the kind of north northeast. So with that, we're once again going to see that influence of Lake Erie where the closer to the lake you are, especially west of Cleveland, a better chance to see a little bit of lingering cloud cover and some colder temperatures. So keep that in mind. National Design Right Hour by our forecast does show a lot of that sunshine though and temperatures uh, towards the south well into the 40s along with that sunshine. So going to be a beautiful afternoon where we see the sun and the warmer temperatures through the overnight hours. And as we head into your Monday, we'll see a little bit of that cloud cover trying to rebuild again. Uh, a chance we might see just a stray flake within those clouds. I definitely don't think that's going to be the case for most of us, but we will see a little bit of additional cloud cover in the picture for Monday that works on clearing out as we get into the second half of the day. Um, temperatures on the hour of hour forecast here showing just the 30s. I think we'll see better than that for tomorrow. I think that's taking into account some colder temperatures around Lake Erie. I think most of us will try for about 40 degrees. Degrees, uh, for Monday. And then we do see improvement for the rest of the week. Uh, still a little bit of a lake influence for Tuesday. And then we are going to see those temperatures improving for everyone. We're well into the 50s by Thursday and Friday. We'll see our next chance for rain returning on Friday.